I've been working in AI now for over 40 years and it's the most exciting time to be working in the field because the tools that we're working on, things like generative AI, are starting to leave the laboratory and turn up in all aspects of our lives. And when people ask me, well, you know, what are the most promising areas for artificial intelligence, I always tell them education is one of them. Uh, AI offers the possibility of giving us a, a wide variety of tools that are going to allow us to personalize education and give us the time to focus on the student in front of us. And what's really exciting is how accessible the technology is. It's not a coincidence that ChatGPT was the fastest growing app ever when it was released. It's now in the hands uh, of over a billion people. And it's the imaginations of those billion people who are going to think of things to do with the technology that you and I could barely imagine. Um, and we're going to see rapid innovation in this space as we fine tune the tools to focus on particular applications and not just be something that just answers questions, but that really provides us a personal tutor to our students. The, the introduction of Gen AI is going to transform many aspects of how we deliver education and teaching. Uh, it's only the very beginning, um, and I think in five years' time, we're going to look back and think at how clunky the tools that we have there today compared to the tools that we will have in five years' time. It's, uh, I'm a bit disappointed that we called it generative AI because that focuses your attention, I think, on the wrong thing. It, it focuses your attention on the idea that these are generative tools, and they are. They can generate stuff, they can generate text, they can generate answers to questions. Uh, they're very good, actually, at generating um, revision qu quizzes for you. Um, but actually, one of the more important, one of the more useful cap capabilities these tools have is their ability to summarize and synthesize information. And a lot of what we do in education, a lot of what we do in our works is summarizing and synthesizing information. And these are really powerful tools. So you can ask them, for example, to provide you some revision notes. You can ask them to give you a re revision quiz. Um, we're going to see them integrated into many parts of the education workflow. Um, specialized and fine-tuned to do those things well.